Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and it's time to play Bloodborne. No fancy introduction, I'm not gonna go on and on about it. I'm just far too excited to actually start playing this game. So, um, real quick, before I actually get into the game and get into the actual uh, me dying a whole lot, let me tell you what to expect. This is blind. I have seen very, very, very little information about this game, and I think that's going to make for a much better blind playthrough uh, for me and for you guys to experience when you watch the videos. But I'm also going to make it somewhat exhaustive, which means that I will be watching and playing cutscenes and probably remaining quiet during them. I will be talking to whatever NPCs I can find, listening to dialogue, trying to understand the lore behind Bloodborne. I'll be reading item descriptions. I'll be going going out of my way to explore um, and just kind of analyzing some of the enemies and the tactics in the game. So anyway, let's go ahead and get in. Let's play online. And um, as soon as I figure out how the password system works, I will be tweeting it out, putting it on the Facebook page. And putting it on the YouTube channel, not that it's going to help any of you live right now, me telling you that that is, but uh, hopefully you're keeping your eye out on uh, those social media networks. Anyway, let's get in. Oh my gosh, this is really, really happening. I have, I have spent far too long today just watching the countdown timer. Alright, Bloodborne server. Failed to log in. <laughs> of course I did. Alright, let's try again. I may have to I may have to start offline. I I imagine there's probably quite a few of us. Alright, one one last attempt and then we'll go offline. Come on, I believe in you. Acquiring data. It worked! Alright. Online play adds a whole new dimension to Bloodborne. Be sure to enjoy this exciting feature. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, got it. Okay. N I guess we're gonna go with new game because I don't have any other uh, any other game to start. Adjust the slider until the man is visible and the beast invisible. Okay. Well, I'm probably not gonna go too dark because of recording wise, so I'm probably just gonna stay with default. If I invert my controls, I'll lose my mind. Oh, yeah. Pale blood. <laughs> well, you've come to the right place. Yarnum is the home of blood ministration. You need only unravel its mystery. But where's an outsider like yourself to begin? Easy, with a bit of Yarnum blood of your own. But first, you'll need a contract. Okay. Character creation. Oh, look at that. Oh, look! I can even look at my feet. I wonder how important that's going to be. Ah, oh, I am tall and skinny. I'm kind of like a kind of like a vampire. And if I'm if I have suspenders, why don't why don't I wear them? Anyway, so. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go through here. I will show you guys the uh, the end result, but I'm not going to make you sit through the actual character creation. So I will uh, I'll be back as soon as I'm ready. Okay, maybe I am actually going to show you a little bit about character creation because this is this is interesting. Your origin actually has something to do with with your stats. So uh, Milk toast, if if that's how I can actually pronounce it. It sounds like a terrible breakfast food. All attributes average. Lone survivor, high life essence and vigor. So you can see the stats in the top right changing. So this is this is basically your class is your origin. So suffered misfortune in youth, highly resilient as a result. Okay, so really high endurance, violent past, terribly violent past, rash but stronger for it. So there's your strength class. Professional, born specialist, fit for sleuthing or academia. So your skill goes up with that. Now can I? There's no there's no tool tips. I, I just took a lot of screenshots because I don't actually uh, know how to use a PlayStation controller. Okay, military veteran, a soldier of strength and skill. That seems like a decent a decent balance. Scion to a respectful respectable line with faith in your pedigree. Skill and blood tinge. I don't know what blood tinge is at all. Arcane. So that sounds like magic. Okay. And waste of skin. You are nothing. Talentless. You shouldn't have been born. Uh, let's pass. Uh, but I think a soldier of strength and skill. Or do I want troubled childhood? I kind of like that endurance. Yeah, we're going with troubled childhood. Okay, 
now I'm going to leave you from here, and I will, uh, I'll show you the finished product. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, here is Bluthius. Bluthius is, or has a, uh, a troubled childhood. He's age mature, he has a mature voice, so interesting that our character will actually have some sort of voice. Whether or not we'll actually be speaking, or if they're just uh, voices during attack animations, we'll see. And uh, I'm wearing glasses, and I guess I sort of kind of made myself look like me? Not really, because I can't match colors uh, to save my life. I am colorblind, and this actually uses a pretty in-depth color uh, scale. So you actually do manipulate uh, three different primary colors in order to create the different colors. But uh, anyway, let's go ahead and finish, and let's get talking to this guy who apparently wants to give us a contract. Perhaps you've seen it. Maybe in a dream. I'm only kidding, that's Dark Souls 2. Good. All signed and sealed. Now, let's begin the transfusion. Oh, don't you worry. Whatever happens, you may think it all a mere bad dream. Why am I getting a transfusion? Okay, so I guess the transfusion's over. Thanks, Doc. Hey, Doc, something went wrong with the transfusion. Um, you apparently spilled some of the blood, which caused this vile beast to spawn. You may, um, maybe, do you have a mop? Why did you just burn? Why did, did I burn you? This game's gonna be really easy if the enemies just die from touching me. I don't know if that's the best design decision, but... Are you the messengers? You kind of look like the messengers. The ones that, you know, have fedoras if you paid a lot of money extra. Why are these things? Ah, you found yourself a hunter. I suppose so. I mean, I think I'm the hunter, aren't I? Oh, look at me in my glasses. It seems really funny to be playing a game like this with glasses. Okay, um, before we even get to exploring, I can already see a note over there. Let's see what the menu looks like. Okay, so I have my attire. So this is a black hood. Are, is there actual... Hood worn upon awakening to the nightmare of blood and beast. Perhaps its wearer had to stay out of sight and travel by cover of darkness. Without memory, who will ever know? Okay foreign garb. Not typical clothing for Yarnum. Perhaps it is of foreign origin. It is said, after all, the traveler came to Yarnum from afar. A faint memory recalls blood administration involving the transfusion of unknown blood. Okay, and that's the same as the vest. Alright, um, I can check my inventory. I have a hunter's mark. Sacrifice all blood echoes and awaken anew. So this is essentially your dark sign. Is that, is that really all I have? I don't even have a weapon? I have no weapon. Okay. Alright, I guess that's all there is to uh, see in the menu. And what do we have here? Handwritten scrawl. Seek pale blood to transcend the hunt. We can do that. Okay, so square is used, but I don't have anything to use. Triangle is something else. There's my dodge, of course. Oh, that's cool. So I I can actually attack melee. Is that is that my sprint? I don't know what that is. What's this little shuffle? Maybe that'll make. Look at the knife hand going. Okay. Doc, I don't really appreciate what you did to me. So 
I'm just gonna wreck some stuff. If that's all right. All right. Open door. Do I want to open door, or do we want to? There's a sprint. Open door this way. Oh, I don't know which way to go. All right. Let's see the other way. Let's hope it's locked. Anytime I begin a game, I hope that most of the doors are locked. So I have to go a specific way. Perfect. Does not open from this side. Thank you, game. Oh, look at the lighting effects. Oh, this game is so atmospheric already. Okay, there's some goop on the floor. There's some goop on the floor here. Oh, they're notes. These are the... These are the messengers. I love the way that they interact. So, R1 is attack with the right hand weapon. Not, uh, not all that shocking. R3 is your lock on. Got it. So clearly this is you, your tutorial area. Look at just all the blood. Oh. Okay. So there's one of those beasts again. If I, if I let it touch me, will I be able to destroy it? I mean, there's, there's a message right in front of him, but I feel like if I get any closer, he's going to see me. Oh, you're not a note. What are you? Come back. Oh, you stupid little monsters. Come back. Can I sneak? There's no sneak. Oh, of course I'm going to die here. Is there any way... Any other secrets? I don't see... Oh, okay. He saw me. Can I talk to you? What do you want to say? What it... I don't understand what that stone means, guys. You gotta use your words. Come on. Give me something. Okay. Alright, we're gonna... We're gonna attack. He doesn't have that much health, actually. Alright, watch your stamina, though. He also... Oh! Oh! Okay, my health is really low. My health is really low. Good dodge. Not so much. There we go. Come on. Oh, I'm two-handing. I'm two-handing, and it's actually doing some decent damage. I don't know if I'm actually supposed to beat this beast. Oh, probably not. Oh, man. Okay. I died. Yeah, well, I'm prepared to see that message quite a bit. Alright, looks like I'm waking up somewhere new, so perhaps you are supposed to die to that boss, but it also might be similar to Dark Souls 1 and Demon Souls, where you have that boss that you run into very, very early on. However, you're not actually expected to, to defeat it right then. But then again, if you do, you might get something special for it. But I guess we'll find out um, on our next character. So, what I'm actually going to be... Okay, so L1 actually two hands, it seems. Or at least right now it does. So, what I'm going to do is, as I play this game and I get the videos uploaded, I am also going to be starting a new character uh, that kind of follows in Bluthius's footsteps. So, I can kind of try to find some of the secrets and find some of the tactics that maybe I missed out on on this blind run. After taking damage from an enemy, there's a period of time in which attacking the enemy in return will restore a certain amount of HP. Okay, so that is the, the regain system, which is very interesting. R1, when, when next to a staggered enemy, is a visceral attack. Cool. Shooting your firearm will interrupt and stagger an enemy. Got it. Hitting an enemy from behind with a charge attack causes them to stagger. Okay, that would have been really, really good to know. So, if I had hit him with that, and then I got next to him with the R1, I could have done a visceral attack. Transform attack or transforming attack. Okay, so when I get my trick weapon, that's when I'll be able to use L1 a bit more effectively. Emergency quick silver bullet replenishment. Use with caution. Performing this action drains HP. Switch weapons. Well, those are fists. Use items. Toggle items is just your down key. Got it. Anything else? No? Okay. There's someone there. We're gonna we're gonna talk to you in a minute. Second ritual altar. First ritual altar. 
A holy chalice is required to conduct a ritual. Makeshift altar. Okay, I wonder if these are for the chalice dungeons. I believe this is actually the hub world. So that might actually be what these are. These are almost like archstones and demon souls. Ritual altars, got it. Open door. And it's closed. Well, I know it's closed, but I tried to open it. Could have actually said, you know, locked or something of that nature. Bath messenger. <laughs> okay, tell me, tell me about the bath. Trade in blood echoes with messengers to buy and sell items. So this is my merchant. Well, I can't really do much. So I have blood vials, quicksilver bullets, Molotov cocktails, and pebbles. Let's let's actually do some quick reading here. Blood vial restores HP. Once a patient has had their blood ministered, a unique but common treatment in Yarnum, successive, successive infusions recall the first and are all the more invigorating for it. No surprise that most Yar Yarnumites are heavy users of blood. These are special bulleted bullets used with hunter firearms. Ordinary bullets have no effect on beasts, and so quicksilver bullets fused with the wielder's own blood must be employed. The strength of quicksilver bullets depends greatly upon the wielder's blood tinge. I saved a video clip. Thank you, PlayStation. Not really sure why. Molotov cocktails. Explodes in raging flames when thrown against an object. We know how Molotovs work. Since the tragedy that struck old Yarnum, fire has become a staple in beast hunts and is thought to cleanse impurity. Certain types of beasts have an abnormal fear of flame. Very, very good. And pebbles can be thrown at foes and it's quite thrilling. Is that all you have for me? Oh no, you actually do sell... So the hunter cap, Ludwig, the first hunter of the healing church, once recruited Yarnamite to serve as hunters. This hunter's attire was made for new recruits and has excellent straightforward defenses, but not nearly enough to allow an ordinary man to stand any real chance against the beasts. And they are all the same. Okay. All right. Very good. Thank you for that, Mr. Bath Messenger. Look, there's another player. Hey, friend. This is exciting. Yarnum Headstone. Awaken at a selected location in Yarnum. Oh. So I could go back to the sick room. And I could actually maybe attack, attempt to take on the boss again. No place to awaken. Did I read? I did read these, right? No, I didn't. I just missed that one. Okay. Let's talk to this individual right here. And then let's see where we're supposed to be going. Oh, you're a doll, actually. That's... that's scary. I'm not a fan of that doll. Okay. Accept a gift from messengers. The messengers offer you a trick weapon. Choose one. Trick weapons are wielded with the right hand and employed in beast hunting. Alright, here we go. Saw cleaver, hunter axe, or threaded cane. This saw, effective at drawing the blood of beasts, transforms into a long cleaver that makes use of centri centrifugal force. Cent centrifugal force. The saw with its set of bloodletting teeth has become a symbol of the hunt and only grows in effectiveness the more grotesquely transformed the beast. The hunter axe retains the qualities of an axe but offers a wider palette of attacks by transforming. It boasts a heavy blunt attack leading to high rally potential. No matter their past, beasts are no more than beasts. Some choose this axe to play the part of executioner. And the threaded cane, sufficiently deadly as a rigid bladed cane, but also serves as a whip when its blade is split into many. Concealing the weapon inside the, the cane and flogging the beast with the whip is partly an act of ceremony, an attempt to demonstrate to oneself that the bloodlust of the hunt will never encroach upon the soul. This sounds like it's my kind of weapon. So let's take a look. So it's, it's the weakest of the three. It does have thrust damage as opposed to blunt or the saw cleaver, which has neither. And let's see. It does seem to have... How do I... Does it have a... Um... It doesn't seem to have any tooltips, not that I can find. But it does have a C in what looks to be skill. I, it, I would call that dexterity. But since I am typically a dex user, the threaded cane is my weapon of choice. Can I use it, or can I not wield it here? Whoa. Oh, no. Oh, I just lost health because I just recharged my quicksilver bullets. Like a fruitcake. A firearm. Okay. Hunter pistol or a blunderbuss. A pistol. Hunter firearms are specially crafted to employ quicksilver bullets fused with the wielder's own blood, boosting damage against beasts. The pistol is a, quick, a quicker draw than the blunderbuss, allowing for speedier response to attacks. 
the impact of the blunderbuss is highly effective uh, or is highly effective weapon to counter beast swift movements and has widespread range is nigh on guaranteed to hit the mark got to go with the pistol a notebook leave messages with these loyal servants to share them with the hunters got it so this would be for leaving messages online oh and there's already notes here a hunter is never alone oh that's really nice um yeah we'll write that up excellent open door you're closed so do I not have my weapon equipped threaded cane got it and pistol oh there it is ladies and gentlemen I like it so now if I transform it oh Oh, how cool is that? What a fun mechanic. That is brilliant. Okay, so let's, uh... That's my R1 combo. That's R2. And what does the power attack look like? Doesn't seem like it has it in the transformed state. What about not transformed? It does. Got it. Alright. Good to know. I guess at this point I go back to the, the sick floor. And my goal is now to, uh... To kill that beast that slayed me. Right? Right. Ayasefka's Clinic. It looks similar to where I was. It's identical to where I was. Okay, so these these should just be tutorials, options menu, back step and quick step. Okay, what was that? Shoot is L2. Return to Hunter's Dream, so that's like my bonfires. So, are these extra notes? Can I go back? Let me see if I can go back to the clinic and see if there's anything. Out on the hunt. Yes? Then I'm very sorry, but I cannot open this door. You can kind of see her right there. I am Yosefka. Yosefka, okay. The patients here in my clinic must not be exposed to infection. I know that you hunt for us, for our town, but I'm sorry. Please. This is all that I can do. What can you do? Just keep the door shut? You gave me a blood vial. Now, go. Okay, can maybe... And good hunting. Oh, well, thank you for that. But can we maybe talk again? Are you still in need of something? I am, yeah, everything. But I have nothing more to offer. Yeah, Sefka, come on. Please, try to understand my position. I have a cane. I can only pray well, for a fruitful All right, hunt. do that then, at least. Okay, so I got Yasefka's blood vial. Invigorates the senses, restoring a large amount of HP. Is this... I'm guessing that this is like a uh, a one-time use, though. Am I wrong? I mean, I guess I might as well get these on my hotbar in case I want to leave notes or whatever. All right. Well, thank you, Yosef Yosefska. I, why is your name so hard to say? Is that beast still here? Oh, it sure is. View scepter. But what does that do? I'm I'm hoping that I'm gonna learn what that does. All right, beast, let's do this. You bested me once before, but not again. Oh, oh, you just got absolutely annihilated. I got my blood echoes retrieved. Okay, I do remember reading that. So the way that works is when I'm killed by an enemy, they're going to actually take my blood echoes. I have to kill that same enemy in order to retrieve them. It's not just a blood stain. It's not a pile of souls. You have to kill that same enemy. And I got some blood vials. Excellent. How do I use a blood vial? View scepter. I don't know what these do. Or specter, rather. Oh, you know what? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. These are the ghosts of other players. That's why there's so many. Okay, so I'm supposed to be able to see their ghost if I interact. But I'm not seeing them. Okay, that's all right. We can, we can always uh, see more later on, I'm sure. And then you hiding behind? No. What were you feeding on? Oh, poor guy. That's probably me. 
That was probably me too. Both those guys are me. Fuse Spectre. Search body. More blood vials. Gotta love the blood. I I feel like ammunition though is going to be so scarce that I really don't want to even use it all that often. Okay, road less traveled, right? That's the plan. All these graves. I don't want to break them, but I kind of do. Because there's probably stuff hidden in them. Nothing out of the ordinary. Look at this town. This is beautiful. I mean, it, it's terrifying, but it's beautiful. We're not going that way. I was just testing the waters. Take more time opening it, though. I mean, you're not in any danger whatsoever. Quicksilver bullets, great. I hear something. I hear something pounding around. Ooh, over there to the left. Sounds, uh, sounds big. Sounds imposing. Closed by a device, probably for the best. Now, all right, I'm gonna try. If I do, no, because if I do up on the d-pad then I actually inject myself with quicksilver how do I use central yarnum how do I use the regular blood vials oh oh man this horse you've seen all kinds of better days huh that's just a manhole cover more blood vials a lot of blood vials so it seems like your healing items might not just be a reusable item. Might just come in the form of these vials. Nothing. Seems like maybe you're locked for a reason. I kind of want to open you, though. Whoa, whoa. What? You must leave. Is there, is there... Do you hear that? I don't know if he's up there. Someone was just telling me that I have to leave. Maybe it's not safe or something along those lines. You. Oh, okay. You are not friendly. I I failed to uh I failed to uh to actually hit him with the bullet. But I got some of my health back. Okay. So you didn't seem like a monster though. You seem like a person doing just kind of what I'm doing. More blood vials. How do I use them, though? Okay, um... Oh, shoot. Back up. Back up. Got it. Alright, so far so good. Molotov cocktails. Excellent. That just switches from those. This switches my weapons. How do I... Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, I know. Beware of man. Oh, thank you. Well, first off, let's get... Uh, let's actually take the notebook off. Let's put Molotovs on. Did I read this? By focusing one's thoughts on this rune, a hunter loses all blood. Okay, so just as if it was a bad dream. Got it. Nothing too special. Easy enough. But how do I... Now, actually, let's try this. Yosefka's blood vial. If I use this, is it going to actually use one of these smaller blood vials? No. No, I just wasted that. Wonderful. How do I use a blood vial, then? That... That is the question. Oh, and that is a waste of a bullet. Well done. I didn't pull the lever. Let's go ahead and do that. Ladder going up. No, thank you. I wonder if these unlock at some point. Maybe there's beasts in them. That sure looks like a door that should open. Closed by device. Alright. Guess up it is. But I need to learn how to use... You know what? Here. Hold on one sec, guys. We're going to go into... Personal effects. I don't know what that is. But no, I want to go into my menu. Which is what? Really, though. What? What is my menu? Oh, there's gestures. Okay. But those are personal effects. How do I... 
Let me figure this out. Because this... This just takes a screenshot. And that's that's not going to help anyone. Um, oh, her... It's right here. So here we go. Let's go into controls. And I can't select what my controls are, can I? No, I can't. Shoot. Attack, attack. What did I just use? What? Seriously, what did I... Did I, did I just use a blood vial? Is it triangle? Might be triangle. I'm not sure. I wasn't paying attention if I had 10 or 11 to begin with. But I'm going to attempt to use triangle... Next time I'm injured. Oh, look at that view. I'm so okay with this. Fear the mob. Oh. Wonderful. Light lamp. This is like a bonfire, I believe. So this is this lamp now transports you back to the hunter's dream. Upon death, you will awaken at this lamp. Perfect. So it is a bonfire. Take a step forward. Is there a trap? Do I fear a trap coming? Nothing here. Nothing so far. Okay. Pebbles. Okay, so I can use these to throw at enemies, and I'm wondering if maybe I can use them to distract as well. We'll, uh, we'll give that a go here shortly. Okay, I, I jumped. I'll, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, let's try a running R1. You jerk. You jerk. More blood vials. No mercy for the lost. Okay, a few enemies down there. We're gonna hold off from jumping. You. I'm not dumb. Oh, you have a shield. You have a shield. But you lowered it, and that was your own fault. Oh gosh, I just... I hear so much going on. So many enemies around me. Wow. Wow. That's a lot of enemies. Oh my goodness gracious. Few notes. Time for the elderly. I don't understand that, that phrase. I don't think I really want to go up against all of them, do I? I can't see it going well. Can I sneak around them? Maybe? Let's just try to be really quiet, okay? Guy might have seen me, though. Nothing in that corner, shame. Oh, hey, 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 I know where I am. I know where I am. Good. Oh, oh. There's a big something or other. Now I have a shortcut, though. Alright, Yarnum. You need to get someone on these doors ASAP, because this takes far too long. And it's going to get me killed. Oh, this guy is going to destroy me. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're not, uh, we're not surviving this fight. Here we go. Ready? <laughs> I almost, I almost thought about dodging. Ooh. Wow, that, that was fast. For him, not for me. All right. I, I kind of want to go try that again. I mean, he does have, he does have my, uh, my blood echoes. And there is a slide mechanic, awesome. Shouldn't have jumped, but I did. Okay. I think the cane is def- Ooh, ooh. Wow. Ouch. So much damage. All right, let's see. Triangle? Yes. Triangle is the winner. You're not alive, but there's more over here, and I want you dead. Because, frankly, I just don't trust you. I don't know how I just missed all those. Switch action. 
Search corpse, blood vial. Well, we might need it. We very, very well may need it for countering this beast. In fact, oh, hey guys, don't mind me, just, you know, trying to kill this thing that's probably impossible. So that doesn't really do any damage. I have to not try to... There we go. He has some serious health. Okay, I didn't stagger like I was hoping to. Ouch. Maybe I shouldn't be trying to kill him. But I'm gonna... Take, uh, whoa, oh jeez. Take two, three? Take three. I'm cursed. Oh. Rolling our ones, very effective. As they should be. Alright, we, we got some good hits on that guy. I just need to play a little bit more defensively, I think. By defensively, obviously I meant just run in there willy-nilly. That didn't, uh, didn't... Alright, quick, 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 heal. Whoa, 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 he's charging. Heal again. That should be a good opportunity. Back up. You know what, maybe I should try the transforming? Let's try it. Maybe I can actually... 15 damage. What was it doing? Ooh! Has a cane. 18. I think the cane. Oh, oh, oh. That's a spin. Alright, let's back up and heal. I like the jumping attack, I'll be honest. I feel like I can ooh, safely get a couple of hits. Come on. I have no idea what you're going to do there, but it cannot be good. This is going well. Famous last words, I know. Come on, jump. No? That was probably a good attack to hit him on. Back up. Let him spin. Dashing R1. Excellent. 27 damage is really good. Finish? Nope, 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 don't get greedy, don't get greedy. There we go, finish. Excellent work. Blood Echoes Retrieved. All right. Search Corpse for four blood vials. Really? That's that's what you wanted to give me, huh? All that work. Is there a chest or something? No, you were just a, you were just a pain in the butt. I apparently had no reason to kill you. <sighs> oh, well, I did kill him, and that's, that's what's important. Now... I have this mob that I need to deal with. How though? Can I... Maybe I can get this guy's attention. Maybe it's kind of like a, uh, a way to pull enemies. Huh? Hey, brother. Come on. Finish. Good. Okay, pebbles are very, very effective at pulling. Excellent. Be careful there's not someone up there. At one point there was. But, thinking. Oh, oh, you're fast. You know what? Can I get the drop on you? Yeah, I can. Now, how much of this can I explore? A whole lot of it. I mean, I shouldn't be surprised. These have never really been linear games. Alright, let's not follow the mob so much right now. Let's go a little bit off the path. What do we have here? Time for men. Alright. It's men time. You got it. Molotov cocktails, great. Probably good for taking out a crowd. Oh, hello. Are you that outsider? I am. Oh, sorry, but I don't want anything to do with you. Trot along, will ya? Oh, but let's try again. 
I have pebbles? I already answered yes. Alright, I don't know who you are or what your problem is, but... I am... Oh, did I just get the one with the shield? That would be lovely. Anything else would be truly unfortunate. Or did I not even get him? No, I didn't. Okay, I'm probably going to leave them alone. That that seems like it's instant death. If I try to take on, what do we got? One, two, three, four. Just four? Okay, okay. There's one with a pitchfork, though. Let's just walk quietly. Now, these are other hunters. So, these are actually not beasts, per se. These are actually other people just kind of going about their business as well. Hello? Oh. Good question. But, I mean, you could have opened it. It was completely up to you. Oh, yeah, I'm not dumb. Get out of here. You're not shooting me. More quick, wait, Quicksilver bullets, but what's that one? I don't know what that symbol next to the Quicksilver bullets, are they different? They're not a quick item. I don't think I equipped them. Hmm. It's a large imposing area. Wow! That's a lot of enemies. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, at least eleven. And they're burning a beast. Okay, that was effective. Alright, do it again. Oh, that was a that was a good ambush, I'm not gonna lie. Reeks of ambush. Huh, well. Maybe to you. No, I didn't I wanted to knock on the door, you dingus. Alright. That's okay. Item up there. Can I knock? No? Alright, tell you what. You guys pay attention to that crazy looking beast that you killed. I'm very proud of you all. I'm gonna... Uh oh. Uh oh. Yep. It's time to... It's time to get out of here. Oh. I didn't get everyone's attention though. Not everyone's crying beast, right? Just a few? Blood vial? Oh, crap. I got quite a few of them coming. But maybe they don't actually know I'm here, so let's... Oh, come on. Whoa. Alright, um... Oh. This is getting dangerous. Get out. Oh. oh, the gun is a lifesaver. Bloodstone shard? Okay. Blood vials? Oh. Whoop, my heart is pounding right now. Okay, can I get over here and check what that bloodstone shard was? Is that okay? Embed and weapon to fortify. A solid shard that forms in cold blood. After death, a substance in the blood hardens, and that which does not crystallize is called a bloodstone. Alright, so it's an upgrade material. You got it. Done. Alright. I think I'm holding my own, right? I think I cleared most of them out. Which... Which is... Which is great. I only have how many left? Four? I don't know if I'm going to be able to pull... Their attentions individually. Or not, but... Before we do that, let's go ahead and take care of... Ah, uh, some more bullets. Great. And then let's deal with this guy. Ready? We're just gonna... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I wasted a lot of stamina. And I got their attention. Phenomenal. What was that? What was that? I don't know what that noise was, but let's kind of get out... Let's reassess the situation. Alright, the people around the burning monster are actually still pretty interested in said burning monster. 
So maybe we can get around and uh, come at them kind of head on. Nothing behind me, right? All right, there's there is something behind, in front of me. There's a mob in front of me. Oh, wow. All right, I have to think about this. I think these guys have lost interest. I really don't want to take on a whole bunch of them. What do you got? Foe waits ahead. Well, yeah, a lot in my case. But that's okay. That's all right. They seem to be hunting. I don't know if they're searching for me or what. But what is this other group doing? Anything? Oh my dear word, you've multiplied. There's six. There's six of them. I feel like I have to just clear this area out. I really do. So... All right, let's do this. Okay, dead. The pebble really does a great job. Now I have a very limited supply, so I might not be able to use too many, but... Oh, hey! You didn't need a pebble. Watch it. Oh, the range on the cane is... Really leaves something to be desired. That is for sure. Alright, so some of them are... Gonna come hang out. Yep. Gotta... I gotta kill this guy quick. Or, or these multiples. Here we go. Come on. I need you to come up without your friends. Here we go. Back up. Excellent. Oh! Oh! Oh my goodness. So that would be this game's version of the repost. And it is absolutely glorious. Alright, now attack that wall. That, that works for me, actually. Uh, why don't you kind of come... There we go. Actually, you kind of terrify me, so I'm going to actually try the same thing on you. Ready? Nope, that didn't work. That did. Want to drop any items for me, huh? I would actually really, really love some pebbles. I know that that's an odd request. Can I... Oh, you know what? Is there a kick? Excellent. Molotov cocktails. All right, we're thinning the herd. We are slowly but surely thinning er, the herd. But a herd still exists. I can take, I don't mind taking one or two. No? Oh, really, guy, come on. It looks like he has a gun, and he's kind of trained down here. So I'm a bit worried to just charge in. But I might have to. I might have to. Oh, yep, yep, I'm being shot at. Time to hastily retreat. Yeah, sorry, pal. I attack faster than you do. And that's a shame for you. For me, it's it's a godsend. I need to get up there and take care of the guy with the gun. That's what I really need to do. Can I get anyone's attention other than you? No? Come on. Hey. Let's go. Guys, I'm... There we go. Got the pitchforker. Good. Get the shield guy. Nope. Uh-oh, uh-oh. The push, the push. The push is very real. How do I push? I don't know how to push. That was not a push, but that actually might be pretty effective against the shield guy. I like the leap forward. That's a really, really nice attack. Okay. So, you guys. Yes, perfect. That's exactly what I needed. And I'm going to sprint our one you. Because you hate that. I shouldn't have gone for the R2. I was trying to use it. 
no, 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 that's gonna get me killed. Back up, he's almost dead. Oh no! Wasn't expecting that. Wow. You really surprised me, Pitchfork guy. Okay. Oh my goodness, this... This is intense, I'm not even gonna lie to you. Ooh, ooh, okay. Come to find out, watch, all the blood or all the blood vials you get in the entirety of the game are in this first section, and I've just, you know, gone ahead and used them all. Alright, now it's time to go get this guy. And get him, hopefully I shall. Yeah, I'm actually going to ignore all others. Alright, not anymore. Okay, you're done. So I have two guys with blunderbusses. Alright, one guy with blunderbuss, right? Oh, and a dog. Pardon me, doggy. I'm sorry. Oh, you don't even look like a, like a demon dog. You're just a dog. Oh, they're all dead. Quicksilver bullets. They are all... That, that doesn't sound like a good thing. In fact, that sounds like it's something that I want nothing to do with. Cold blood dew. Is it a quick use item? It is. Used to gain blood echoes. Okay, so this is like a soul item. Hunters sustained by the dream gain strength from blood echoes. They imbibe the blood with thoughts of reverence, indeed gratitude, for their victims. Any hidden areas? I can go actually up to the left. I'm afraid if I go grab that item, something something not good's gonna happen. I mean, I think that's a pretty rational thought, right? Maybe not. I can't. I can't really see on the other side of it though. Not the bloodstone shard, so that's the upgrade material. Blood vials. Need those. Someone's either laughing or being torn to shreds. I can't tell. Oh, it's laughing. It that's that's laughter. What did I just see? Knock. Okay, I can knock. I don't reckon you're from round here. Well, stuck outside on a night of the hunt. Oh, you poor, poor thing. I have glasses on. I'm practically Harry Potter. Alright, fine. Alright, I don't know. I still feel like there might be something down by that door, so we're going to tread. Yeah, I was right. It's one of those guys. Can I go get the item safely, though? Do we think I can get the item? I'm not so sure that I think that. What are you? Okay. Your crow demons. Got it! Wowzer, you frightened me. An oil urn. Urn that covers target in oil. Okay, so this would make them, I would guess, more susceptible to flames. Made extremely flammable. That makes sense. Fire's commonplace on the hunt, and oil urns accentuate its effect. Sometimes, when hunters turn bee or burn bees, they appear intoxicated by the, eufo the euphoria of purification. I can't speak. Oh, jeez. I mean, I had, I had some decent luck against that guy before. If he is indeed the same type of monster. Someone's coming. Sounded like they were running, but we're gonna go get this item we saw behind the gate. Nothing's coming up from behind. Cold blood dew, so more free blood echoes. I feel like I should really go take him on, but I want to go see maybe what that item was. I, d I just don't know. Is he going to come crashing through the door? Take your bets now. We're gonna go get the item, but place your bets now. Is that big guy... 
going to come crashing through the door as soon as I grab that item and it's an instant death. I mean, it just looks that way, doesn't it? But unless I unbar it, it's just a couple of blood vials. Alright. Good. He doesn't come crashing through. Well, let's go, uh... <sighs> let's go take him out. We got this. No sweat, everyone. No sweat. Can I, uh, can I maybe get a drop attack? What does he have? A brick? Time for fire. Ooh, good call. Good call, guy I don't know. Let's actually maybe use an oil urn. Huh? And then, and then a Molotov? Can we do that? Alright, ready? Wow! Wow! He is just about dead. Can we just... Messenger? I don't know who you are. Was it you? Yeah. You absolutely get an upvote for that. Beautiful. Couple of blood vials for my trouble. Bunch of Molotovs. And a torch. I wish I could unlock that. That would probably be a good shortcut. Now a torch. Is that a weapon? It is. It is a weapon. And that's very intriguing to me. Hunters choose torches not only because the hunt leads them to the darkest nooks, but also because certain creatures they encounter are possessed by a deathly fear of flame. Aha! Well, great! Alright! I think we're making progress. I think we're making some actual, real progress. Nothing over there. You, guys, you gonna let me knock here? No? Open gate, closed by a device. Maybe that will actually be a nice shortcut. There's a dog, a couple of prowling dogs, no big deal. I don't want him to see me. I would like to get the jump on him. Oh, and you know, just, just a whole slew of enemies too. Where are you? All right, reset. Good. One down. The dogs are dead. One enemy's down. Or one hunter, I should say. Oop. Okay, R2. Gotta start using that a bit more often. Oh, bad time to, bad time to loot. Get it. I got it. You're, you're reloading. Come on, doggy. Come on. You are nimble, aren't you? Sorry, pal. I'm used to playing a light character. So it's working for me. Bunch more blood vials. I don't know why some have the symbol next to it. I, I don't quite understand that, so I'll have to figure that out at some point. Was this the only way for me to go? It was, because that other gate was closed by a contraption. Door I can't knock on. Few notes. Take a step forward. Remember oil. Okay. Why? Why do I want to remember oil? That's why. Okay. If he... Oh, there's two. I don't want to fight two if I can help it. Can I help it, though, is the question. Did I get one's attention? Come on. Come on, big boy. Oh, you have way, way more health than the first one I fought. Nope, missed. Come on. Nope. Oh, no, no. Time to back up, back up, back up. All right. We're running. We are running. We are, if we can, going to get... Did I get the one? I did. Uh oh. I would like to heal if I can. Oh. 
That was a bad, bad roll. Bad roll. Okay. Time to reset again. Who has the, the low health? You have it. So I really, really want to actually go for you. Go. Finish. Finish. Okay, heal. Oh, jeez. I would like to get maybe a stun on you. You know what I should do? Ow. Ow! Oh, you got to be kidding. Oh. Oh, that was so good, though. That was really, really good. I mean, okay, up until I died. That was really good. 